Recently, natural material based composites are in demand due to their superior physical chemical and biological properties. We have developed novel composites using silk as a reinforcement materials in our lab. As we know that there is an enormous demand for bone graft biomaterials to treat congenital and acquired disorders in the form of trauma, tumor or infections. So we have developed a novel natural fiber reinforced composite with polycaprolactone and silk. We have utilized two silk variants, Bombax Mori and Anthera Mylita. Via a process of degumming, we have obtained silk fibroin and then this silk fibroin undergo hydrolysis to form silk fibroin microfibers. These microfibers are mixed with polycaprolactone to form the composite. We have done all the in vitro characterization procedures and then uh, we have also optimized the 3D printing protocol via extrusion based 3D printer, 3D bioplotter and vision tech. Once we have uh, optimized all the protocols, we have also printed the patient defect specific model via the CT scan obtained. We are using this particular material, PEDG based silk microfiber reinforced composite for 3D printing and developing uh, processes, uh, prototypes uh, using this particular material and uh, we are uh, testing this printed objects for uh, different loading conditions. We have tested these materials for various assays and we found very good results. We have also developed a protocol to 3D print these composites into customized 3D structures like orthosis, prosthesis and implants. The other area of research in our lab is fabrication of tissues and organs using 3D bioprinting technology. When we add biomaterial along with cells in the, as an ink in the 3D printing system uh, to fabricate tissues and organs, we term it as 3D bioprinting. We in our lab have developed bio inks which are derived from xenogenic sources. Tissues such as cornea, liver, esophagus, skin, etc. are in current research in our lab and among which the 3D bioprinted cornea has shown us promising results in the animal studies which we are conducting conducted very recently. Uh, so we envisage that all the tissues which are being fabricated in the in vitro conditions have a potential in uh, translational and regenerative medicine in the future. Various biomedical products like customized implants, orthosis, prosthesis have got huge application in defense to develop the capacity and capability in the direction of Make in India so that we can produce these customized devices indigenously in India. Thank you.